Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm in a bit of a rogue outfit but that's okay because I'm changing very soon. Uh, I feel like this is a big uni mood. So for today's video I have a huge ASOS parcel. It's literally massive. I have some stuff that's already like fallen out because I have opened this, I'm not gonna lie. Um, basically, I have let YouTubers pick my ASOS haul. I have given them no guidance whatsoever. I was literally like, pick whatever you want. So from what I've got and like what I put in my basket, I just whacked in like one item from every YouTuber that has messaged me and actually given me these. I didn't want to message anyone and make them feel pressured to pick anything or, you know, I just didn't want anyone to feel uncomfortable. So I literally just put it on my story on Instagram and any YouTuber that replied with the link, I pretty much whacked straight in my basket up to 10 items just so it didn't go too over the top and that this video wouldn't be so boring for all of you. Um, but from what I picked and whacked in the basket, all I can tell is that some people have gone for something they think would suit me. I've got stuff that are just really random and obviously just like something funny to try on. Some people have definitely picked their style of clothing to see what it looks like on me. So this is going to be super, super interesting. I'm really sorry my hair's looking a bit dodge. It's because it's greasy so I just wiped it back. Um, but yeah, this is going to be a very fun video and I'll obviously pop all of the people who have helped me out by picking the items down in the description so you guys can check them out. And yeah, thank you for to the YouTubers for getting involved. And yeah, I think this will be a very fun video of me trying on lots of different random pieces and some pieces that I think you guys will love too. So I'll leave all the items down below in case any of this is your style but something you may want to pick up yourselves. Let's go. <laughs> so, first up, I have a bag that Selena picked out. Selena picked out this gorgeous little black bag and I absolutely love this. This is something I would definitely pick up myself. I love a bit of crock print, especially on monochrome colours like black. Like I absolutely love this. I think it's a lovely size as well. It also has a longer strap inside as well. So if you wanted to make this a little bit bigger, but I quite like the short strap because I'm just on the wrist so you can, you know, pop down to the shops. I think this is a great first item in the haul. Also love that it has gold hardware because I am a girl who loves gold jewelry and prefers it over silver. Um, so this would go with all my accessories too. And I just think this is just a really good all round piece. I'm obsessed with bags. It does look very similar to this one that I've got, as you can definitely see. So this one here is from Misguided. This one I think is ASOS own brand, I believe. Yeah, it's ASOS's own brand. Um, but yeah, they're very similar, so you can definitely tell Selena knows my style. And yeah, I absolutely love this. I think it's such a little, a lovely little pick if you're looking for a new bag that you can take on nights out where you can still like put your purse, your phone, keys, money in, you know? It fits it all in, it's not ridiculously mini. So yeah, perfect. Big thumbs up, Selena, thank you. So the second item is this jumper, picked by the lovely Emily Rose Fisher, which she actually told me that she owns herself and she's recently bought and she absolutely loves it. I've seen it on her Instagram and I absolutely love it. It's so her. Um, I used to be a massive fan of mint green as well. So this like throws me back to the time where I literally bought mint green everything. Um, it's just like a classic, cute little mint green knit jumper. It's sort of like, not cropped, but it just sort of like sits on the waistline, like, I don't know, I just really like the actual fit of it and it's just really baggy, really cozy, perfect for the winter months. And yeah, I think it just brings that nice little like spring transition as well, which is perfect. And I just think this is very Emily and I really like it, it's so cozy. And this is actually Topshop as well, just Topshop on the ASOS website. So yeah, absolutely love it. The quality is unreal. Um, it just feels very cozy and it's not an itchy material too, which is something I always look out for because my skin is very sensitive and it's just like a really cozy warm knit. I'd also like to layer some like white turtlenecks underneath I think as well because I think that would be a really cute little look. So yeah, big thumbs up to this piece too. Right, so next item, I'm gonna zoom you out a little bit just so you can see because it does go a little bit longer. This item was picked out by the lovely Chloe Firth. Again, ASOS's own brand. It is this gorgeous, like really long line, black fleece. It is so woolly and soft. Like I'm absolutely obsessed with it. So it has Boston written over the chest. It zips all the way down and up. I have nothing underneath at the minute, so I'm not gonna zip it all the way down. But yeah, it's got like a full zip. So it's like perfect if you wanted to layer. But I would personally have like either a turtleneck underneath 
um, so it gives a little bit of layers and a little bit of detail or I just wear it with like a black top underneath and just have this as the main piece I'd probably always have it done up though because I think it might look a bit silly with um, like the word split but yeah I absolutely love this I would definitely wear it myself this is definitely a very good uni outfit something easy and quick to throw on also cozy as well for the winter these winter days so yeah another big thumbs up to this item um, something I definitely recommend if you're looking for some like nice nicer cozy outfits because that's something I get asked a lot on Instagram like how do I make really casual cozy outfits look nice in the streets um, I personally don't think I look nice but this is definitely something I'd go for so like I'm wearing really cozy black joggers now I'd wear this to uni like a really oversized baggy black outfit and just go for it I just think you just have to have the confidence just go out and I think you look fine so believe and feel that you look fine and you will be no one's judging you um, but yeah so definitely something that I'd wear to uni again and just ideal for this time of year so yeah thank you very much Chloe I also love that it's just black and white as well very simple and cute so Jess from It's Jess Louise has picked out this gorgeous like red and black check flannel shirt. I haven't worn these since I was about 12, 13 and I don't know why because I absolutely love this. I've actually been wearing it a lot. Like I took this to Berlin, the little trip that I went to. Make sure you go check out my vlog. Me and Meg went to Berlin for our Watch Mystery holiday. But yeah, it, I even took this with me. So I had a sneak peek of the parcel before um, I'm showing you guys and I just fell in love with this. So I'm obsessed i think they're these shirts are so much more versatile than you think i think obviously i'm wearing joggers now but i wore these in berlin with some black mom jeans and a nice thick belt make it a little bit grungy with some boots and a beanie i just think there's so many ways you can go with this you could even wear this on your own if you're just chilling in the house just something to lounge around and um chill in and then again i think you can have like a bralette joggers and have this like open with like no buttons done up i just think there's so many different looks you can create with a shirt maybe that's something i'll do on my instagram like a styling check shirt video but it's made me want to go out and get loads more different colors and some more neutral tones as well like i absolutely have fallen in love with this and it's something i never thought i would ever pick up again so thank you jess for bringing this to my <laughs> bringing this to my life it's made me realize that I like this sort of style of clothing on me and just in general so yeah thank you <laughs> okay so this next one is kind of a fail so Shauna has picked out this lovely little yellow and black polka dot dress it does a little tie around the middle here which is really nice obviously since she's in the figure like I'll show you what it looks like if it's tied up um, it is a really flattering like dress however the the zip has got stuck and I can't pull it up here and um, pretty little thing are really annoying and have these really extra long like I get why they do it it's obviously so people don't wear it and then return um, but it's really frustrating because it keeps getting like stuck in the zip and like prevents you from actually trying things on to their like full ability but as you can see here the dress is like relatively short like it's above knees um I feel like my bum might fall out but this is a cute little summer dress if you're into this style I personally don't like this on me but I can see why Shauna's picked it because I can definitely see this piece on her um I just I just think I am not very like girl a girly girl I hate using terms like that but I'm just not a girly girl it does I just feel like it doesn't look right on me because I don't wear this stuff often because it's got like the puffy sleeves like it's just very like preppy and I just feel like I'm a little slug that likes to whack on some joggers and be in a big hoodie and just like walk around everywhere all cozy and this is like very prim and proper for me you know what I mean um but yeah I do like the peas I'm not sure if I would pick these colors on me if I'm honest but I think like I can definitely see Shauna in this so I definitely know why she's picked it it is like I said very flattering too like I completely understand why people would pick this out but yeah like I said it's not my style but it's nice to try something new and yeah okay <laughs> so this is the next piece this was picked out by Han Thompson hi Han thank you very much for this one I think this is so cool I just can't pull it off <laughs> I just can't pull stuff like this off. So this is from Collusion, which is one of ASOS, ASOS? ASOS's new brands. I love all the Collusion stuff. I think it is so cool. Like most of it, or maybe all of it, is unisex as well, which I think is such a cool ethos, I guess. Um, and yeah, so this is a, one of the two-piece sets. It's sort of like a, sh um, a mini cropped shirt and some like joggers in the same print. 
Um, the joggers are not very comfy at all, I'm not gonna lie. Like, you definitely need to size up. I feel like I could break out of these any single second now. I'll zoom you down quickly so you can see what these look like. So these go all the way <laughs> like this. <laughs> I just don't think, I just don't think these are a bit of me. I don't think I could pull these this off. It is quite a cool set. Like I definitely love the matching coordination. I love a good cohort. Um, I just don't think I am cool enough to pull off such a dramatic print as well as the satin. Like I don't know where I'd wear this and feel okay. But yeah, I definitely think so many people could pull this off and look absolutely amazing in it. It has like game over written. <laughs> um, all over the piece such a cool set but just i i'm not cool enough for this like come on look at me right so moving on to the last three items these are all trousers or like bottom half so i'm gonna try and move the camera to make it a little bit easier for you to see sorry for the weird angle i can't really see what's going on but so next i have these really cute little loungewear joggers these are from asos's own brand these were picked out by the lovely ellie um i absolutely love her content i think she is such a motivated driven individual and i just love her energy like on her social media so definitely recommend checking ellie out um but yeah she picked out these gorgeous like nude beigey ribbed joggers they are so comfortable like i would highly recommend these if you're looking for something nice to chill out in that's really comfy and i feel like i would even go out in these i'm not gonna lie i definitely feel like i could go out in these even maybe with this white hoodie to uni just yeah i just think they're very very cozy they also have a little drawstring here if you wanted to cinch it in a little bit at the waist um, but yeah, this is an amazing pick, so thank you very much, Ellie. These are so cosy. Much cosier than my other joggers. <laughs> right, okay, so the penultimate item is this black midi skirt picked out by the lovely Alice Thorpe. So this is very Alice, like, I feel very Alice, like, in a midi skirt. Something, again, I definitely don't go for, especially, like, a non-fitted midi skirt as well. Like, I just think I don't look right in them. Again, I think it's because I'm always in joggers or jeans. So anything, like, a skirt is always going to make me feel a little bit scared and uncomfortable. I'd wear this with something white on the top, a little cute black handbag, maybe the one that Selena picked out for me. Something cute, some little boots, make it a little bit cutesy but yeah i don't know how to feel about this like i think i like it but because i don't wear stuff like this often i feel a bit nervous and i feel like i would feel a bit on edge going out in public like because i just don't feel like me i just feel like i look a lot older maybe not i don't know i just feel like i look, I look a lot older but if you are into midi skirts this is a really good this is a really good piece this is asos's own brand again very good quality that it's slightly pleated as well which is quite a nice little touch i feel like a lot of people can definitely pull this off but because i'm a little loungewear girl i just don't feel like myself if you know what i mean but yeah thank you very much alice for picking this out it's definitely been very fun and interesting to style and last but by no means least um lucy wood has stitched me up here with my last item i cannot pull these off but i think these would look sick on some people i just this is just very different very different to what everyone else has picked out so thank you lucy for this one um but it's definitely been fun to put on ready Ta -da! <laughs> bright neon pink flares translucent pv belt this is probably the most out, out of my comfort zone i will ever be in but I'm sort of feeling it, trying something a little bit new. Um, this was the only top I could find that sort of like I could put with it because I couldn't find any other like tight white top that I would wear this. But this would be good for a fancy dress, I feel. Like if you were going for like an 80s vibe, you could consider. But I just don't know if I could pull these off. Maybe with some heels. I feel like you'd need like these big, huge platform boots and like proper go all out because I feel like this neon pink is just a lot. <laughs> God. They fit really nicely though, so um, I definitely recommend st staying true to your size. I'm wearing a size 12 
the reference. Like I, like everything, I'll leave these down below if you enjoy them. Thanks, Lucy, for picking such an extravagant item. It's definitely made this haul very fun. So thank you, Lucy, for picking a really interesting item to finish off this video. I really appreciate it. Thank you to everyone again for getting involved. I'm also doing a subscribers pick my ASOS haul very soon, which you guys have got involved in. This has been really fun because I've been able to try new styles, um, find new pieces that I really like, and also try out some really crazy things too. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Let me know if you wanna see any more fashion challenges on my channel, I would absolutely love to do more, more things like this or if not I'll do some with some of my friends because I feel like it'd be really fun to buy for each other and try and pick out outfits and um, yeah thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye